Hey guys, welcome to another video. My name is Nick. I'm Shannon. Today we are going to be going through all our mail that we've gotten in the last couple Yay. weeks. While we've been away in California, our mail has really piled up. <laughs> in these packages that we have, there are multiple collections in there. They're not huge collections, but they are pretty nice size. So I'm really excited to start going through these. But let's show you guys all the mail that we have. So here's our little pile up of mail we got here. You can kind of tell which ones are going to be the collection. So there's one in here, here, and I think this box might have one as well. So there's a lot of stuff that we got to get through. So if you guys are ready, let's go ahead and start opening these guys up. All right, you going for a pick, Shannon? Where are we start? We start in there. That's actually a pretty lame box to start on. <laughs> this feels like nothing. Yeah, I gotta start on them so that way we can open up these packages easy, but look at what we what was in this box here. This is a holy grail for Emperor's New Groove. Look at this Disney Auctions Yizma. Disney Auctions are some of the hardest to come by pins, and this one's only a limited edition of 250. And the other pins in this box, there was only a couple of them, but they are really nice ones. They're old waffle back pins for Emperor's New Groove. Alright, we got our next box. Give me your jagged toenail. <laughs> what? It needs something to cut it open with. Come on. Here you go, Shannon. <laughs> All right, I'm seeing a nice little bundle here. What came in this package? I see a Hercules. Look at that. So this first one here, this is pretty nice. So this is an old Hercules and Margara retired rack pin. Oh, does it spin or something? An Indiana Jones. No, no, it's just a 3D pin. That's yeah, there's two layers of this pin, so. What else is in here? Daisy Cheshire. I haven't seen this pin in a long time. A house, Indiana Jones, Mickey. Oh, do you have this one, Shannon? I think you might. It's a little pin trading cards oh, yeah. one. You do? It's up there. There it is. Oh my gosh, look at this. This is one of the honey matching stretching portraits with Daisy on top. Oh. And look at that. This person got an amazing deal on that. This one looks like it came from the character warehouse. When? Yeah, exactly. What the heck? This one looks loaded. Oh yeah, that is stuffed full of pins. Let's see what pins are in there. Oh. That was hard to pull out too. All right, it's nicely packaged. And let's see what's in here. And looks like it is a whole bunch of older hidden Mickey's. Look at those monorails, the Autopia cars. Oh, this is a really cool set of Robin Hood pins. That's a lot of monorails. Yeah, some some wanted signs. And there is a it's nice little set? set of monorails. There's actually so many in the monorail series. I have no idea how many there are. It could be the whole set, but I oh, doubt it. I didn't know they made more. Oh, yeah, one. this is some oh, some more really awesome hidden Mickey's. So these the fairies. Yeah, look at that. I, yeah, it looks like these are the authentic ones because these snowflake, the snowflake series is pretty commonly scrapped. Not all of them, but I know she for sure Honestly, is. Honestly, a lot of these are commonly scrapped. Yeah, but yeah, like look at this. There's an old superhero hidden Mickey set and the Caballeros. Is this one real too? Ah, uh, I mean he's not orange like all the ones that we normally see. <laughs> What's this one? This is cool. Oh, this is Belle's Castle, I believe. <laughs> all right, what box is getting selected up next? All right. Let's see what's hiding in this one here. All right, we got some uh, miscellaneous stuff in here. What is this? Ooh, from Robin Hood. Does it tell me that? This is a nice old Robin Hood one, 2001. Look at him. A spinner pen, Epcot Goofy with an x-ray. That's kind of interesting. Lilo. Lilo. Who else is hiding in here? A nice little pen. Still in its little red baggies. These are red flags when you see these. Because, you know, any of them in the red bags, those are not going to be authentic ones. But looks like they still had some nice ones mixed in. This is a really old Minnie Mouse. Oh, that is an old Minnie Mouse. That's cool. Mm, Pluto. All right. What do we have in this next box here? Ooh. Ooh, a bunch of individually oh. bagged ones. It does look like there's a lot of like newer uh, uh, limited edition pins in here. Oh, some coffee cups. Oh, you know what? I think this is a package that I did a bulk trade with. I traded away one of my really high end pins for a bunch of for someone's pins that they were looking to get rid of, which is all this stuff in bulk. So let's uh, unbubble and see what I got. 
All right, now that we got them all set up, there's some really nice pins in here. And what's really interesting is there are these ice cream cones. I'm wondering if these are the authentic ones because these ones are commonly scrapped, but these ones look better than uh, better than the ones we usually see, that's for sure. They do look better, but they still look green, so I'm not sure. Yeah, I'll have to do some more research on those, but lots of cool stuff. There's some of the uh, from the Star Wars Girls Ooh. mystery box. That's a newer one. And over here, there's some popsicles. And what else is hiding? There's still a bunch of these bundles. Yeah, I forgot. Yeah, the, this was for multiple of my high-end pins. That's for sure. That's why there's so many pins in here. Look at this. This is really cool. This is a Haunted Mansion puzzle. Is this the whole one? I think it's all six pieces to it. Yeah, it's a Loungefly uh, Haunted Mansion puzzle. Ooh, I kind of want to see uh, And then, let's see. There's some uh, Avenger Hidden Mickeys. What else are you finding in here? Oh, it's one of the, uh, the like florals. The Jasmine. Jasmine. And this one looks to be a bunch of lounge fly stuff as well. Oh, look at that Rapunzel and Flynn. Some Remy ones. And what is this? Oh, it's a soul pin. Aren't you collecting these, Shannon? Uh, the Ariel and Jasmine is what we just got. I, I put your other ones that we had over there on your corner. I don't think you have those. Yes, I only have those up there. They're in a section because I, I can never remember which one. You got are. you got to start there, Tiana and Cinderella. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Too bad. Okay, I kind of like these, and there's almost all of them. And I can put them together. Yeah, this princess series is for each season of the year. We got three of them. Who are we missing? What? Who's the first one? Oh, we're going for another big box. Yep, this is a collection. So let's see what is in there. Woo! All right, let's start off. Look at this nightmare set that was right on top there. 2011 Happy Halloween. If they only didn't put 2011. Yeah, see, it would be very nice if they didn't date pins like that, because now that the year has passed, not a lot of people want to collect uh, pins that say 2011 on them, but... They are really beautiful nightmare ones. What we got? The three caballeros. Oh, this is a cool Lion King pin. Lion King and the Mary Poppins. Is there anything in this big thing? Yeah, so look at this. So this is a set from uh, D23. It was a little promo set you got for being a D23 member in, uh, I forgot the year. Maybe it was 2019 when they released these. All right, then there's one from the Mickey Main Attraction series. Of a bag with Chippendale lanyards. Wow. What do you spot? When they match. Oh, yes. Look at that. Stone. Is it all Chippendale? Yeah. Oh, look at this. Let's take a look at this lanyard. This is a really cool Chippendale one. A little Pirate's Lair Chippendale. Chippendale a Halloween like one. Oh, my God. Oh, nope. <laughs> Somehow a Lion what? King one made it on there. <laughs> no. <laughs> I know. All of them. How about this lanyard? No, this lanyard is... Is all Chippendale, oh, huh? I have this one. That's funny how the Lion King snuck his way on there, but <laughs> some really awesome Chippendales. Look at that. Happy holidays. Oh, it opens up. 2009. <laughs> what is in the little baggie here? It looks like a bunch of rock pins. It's a birthday cake. We got Aurora, Black Panther, some more princesses. And from, uh, what was that, a Wine and Dine 10K? All right, for the grand finale, check out this. This is an old pin trading book. A little pin trading folio. I don't know what they call them, but look at this. It's a very unique style, is for sure. Oh, and we opened it up to some stitch pins. And Nemo, Ooh, look at this one. This is a piece of history, Nemo. So that's a little tiny, tiny piece from the Nemo submarine voyage. Tower oh, Tower of Terror. This is a cool trifold pin. Look at that. Who's on our next page? Some Halloween Ooh. pins. That's a really cool Jack. Whoa. Halloween Screams. Does it have a year hidden on there? I don't see a year on this pin. Yeah. That means that's a really nice one. That is a giant nightmare one, though. Oh, they move? Oh, they go up and down in the <laughs> cauldron? That's pretty cool. Top row of just princesses. She moves, she moves, too. Sally moves out. Oh, you know what? It looks like there was a piece supposed to be up there. Oh, no. A Jack Coffin. And little tiny oh. z oh this is a really awesome uh nightmare one haunted mansion holiday her outfit i need this one that one's going in shannon's halloween collection i want to wear that small world holiday spinner 
All right, next page. The low and slow. Oh, I'm assuming yeah, you yeah. got that one. Yep. I love you. A long, long time ago. <laughs> Phineas and Ferb. Another one that, that I pinch you again. Oh. 101 Jump. Oh, this is a really nice big Peter Pan pin. Wow. Let's see. Then there is Maleficent. The heart comes out of the... Oh, the mailbox the opens mailbox. up to a heart. Uh -huh. Let's see. We still got another page in here. Yeah, we still got another page. Gosh, an orange bird. Look at that castle, little up castle. I like this one. Mickey from Disney Paris. And this. Did I get rid of that? Because I wanted to This get is it. a cute little couple set. So Mickey and Minnie's uh, mouths are actually magnetic, so they'll, they'll clip to each other. I will keep it again. A 2012 passholder stitch and a nice little orange bird Epcot ball. Is that all of them? Oh. I, oh, you know what? Oh, wow. <laughs> Hiding for us on the last page. We got a page of Avengers. <laughs> And I think that's going to finish us off for that one. <laughs> All right, now we got to open up some of the smaller ones. Uh, oh, there's a lot of loose ooh, pins in here. Is that uh oh. A huge button? Oh, I didn't even realize that. <laughs> I want to know what's on there. That's going to be a nice little mystery. It says Disney right there. And what is this? To, like, yeah, if you want to turn it into a frame. Okay. Uh, <laughs> that's a lot of text on there. What, who wears that? That's bigger than my face. Yeah, you just gotta wear that around for the meme. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen a button this big. Oh my gosh, it's a wedding pin and it's not Ariel. Oh, it's Cindy. She's got your hair, do huh? Do we have that yet? I don't think we do have that. Oh Let's see. Uh, so this is the little culprit who didn't have a back. His back fell off. It was a little angel. Oh Bart. my gosh. For your Simpson collection. Yes. And Mickey there. All right. Mickey 200 winner. <laughs> All right, next one. All right, we got some backer cards in here. Oh, what the heck? That's, it's so thin. Oh, yeah, the, that is a very thin pin. Oh, it's a safety clip style. Davy Jones. Jones. That's a cool Alice in Wonderland one from the 50th anniversary of Disneyland is what it looks like. Oh my god. A SpongeBob racer pin. I love this. My a new universal. SpongeBob. New. <laughs> I love SpongeBob. Who else is hiding in here? There's a Mickey. Oh, I seen this. Doesn't he like Yeah, he moves up and down. Doing. <laughs> Tinkerbell and 2007. Oh, yeah. All right, next package. Some bubble wrap. Pin rolls. More bubble wraps. Some pin burritos. All right, let's pin get those burritos. opened up. All right, so this one was definitely one of my bulk trades. So I trade away another one of my bigger pins for all these little tiny hidden Mickeys and everything. Tower of Terror. And now there was some cool ones in here, like the uh, old Disneyland uh, 60th anniversary diamonds. Next package. What do we got? A lanyard. Interesting. There's like stuff in here. <laughs> one way to pack it, I guess. We got some princesses and mm. Mickey and Minnie. Princess Oakley. Boo Bear. Oh, he looks like he has a wedgie. And he has all his diamonds. That's one thing you gotta watch out for for those uh, studded pins like that. Okay, but does he not look like he's picking a wedgie? <laughs> right? All right, we got some more lanyards in there. Why do I hear so many jingles? It's a Christmas <laughs> lanyard. Oh my gosh. Look at that. It is loaded of zooms and little jingle bells. Oh, and that one's an empty lanyard. All right. I think you found your favorite thing in the package. These are the best bubbles. Ah, All right. So we got some Halloween pins in here. I like the Eeyore and the Tigger. And what's the other one? Oh, look, there's matching poo here. Another Tigger. Oh, did you find another pin you oh. needed? The Sully ears. Yay, I literally have these ears. They're not in here, but... <laughs> there we go. That just about does it. <laughs> Ooh. We got some buttons. Special thank you to Haley for this package. Look at this sticker. Isn't it neat? I didn't mean to sing that. <laughs> it's the way I said, it. look at this sticker. It sounded like the song, so I continued. Look, there's special things in here. Ah, I love stickers. Oh my gosh. That's 
All right, yeah, there's quite a few baggies in here, so let's get them opened up and spread them out. What'd you find? You found Groot? Groot Rocket mixed together pumpkin. <laughs> Yeah, this is from the little pumpkin series, but it totally looks like a crossover between Groot and Rocket. It does. Oh my gosh, look. It's a Jonas Brother pin. Ooh. Who else is hiding in here? There's a lot of really neat ones. And then there's all these Vanellope pins. And these ones over here, I almost thought these were fantasy, but no, look. They're just little tiny ones, finish each other sandwiches. They but they were from a Disney store set in their yeah. limited edition. Oh, you know what? I think they might have been with the, uh, the Vanellope set there. Yeah. I want these ones. Let's see. Who else is hiding in here? There's some of the Club Penguin Puffles. And to my surprise, these ones are very commonly scrapped, but these ones look like the authentic ones. Oh, this part of a oh yes, that's part of a little uh, 50th anniversary Mickey icon of the uh, Magic Kingdom map. A little Tinkerbell guitar. Who is this? A Sorcerer Mickey flipped over. Olaf Scuttle, another Vanellope. And this is a pretty cool dwarf one. Mm. It is on the older side as well. And I saw Waffle Back. And some limited edition ones up here. All right, big box. <laughs> so this one, this is another collection. As you can see here, look what is right on top. It is a whole page of Disney Channel pins. Yeah, Disney Channel's uh, ones can definitely be harder to find, so it's really nice to see an entire page full of them. What are you plucking off there? I'm Shannon. Look at this. You're watching Disney Channel. Do, 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 do. That, is, that is a very unique fan. I don't think I've seen one like that before. But yeah, if you're a Hannah Montana fan, oh my, are we stocked up on those? Handy, 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 man. What is this? This is a princess page is what it's looking like. One of the newer Aerial Mystery Box and some reflection ones. A whole bunch of puzzle pieces of Lumiere. <laughs> oh, there's things on the back. I was wondering what you were doing. Monsters University, the McQueen pinball machine. But that one is on the board. Oh, yeah, this is a little hinge pin that opens up to Walt Disney as a little child. Look at this little army man. That's a cool one. Oh, yes. Love this one. Oh, a little princess door. And it's got Ariel on the inside. It opens. And this is a uh, empty pin bag. They ripped out the pages of this. Now it's just like a pencil case, I guess. But let's find out what's in this pin folio. It's all, uh, is that all the designer dolls? There's a lot of them there. And look at these amazing pirate pins. So these ones are WDI LE 500s, I think. But it's a really cool Pirates of the Caribbean set. They're so tiny. Oh my gosh, the Pooh Bear Strawberries. Um, Space think, Mountain. You put a name in there, right? Oh, is that what that is? Yeah, it looks like it's definitely supposed to have something in the middle there. But we don't this. have the piece that goes to the middle. Yeah, you can stick something in, see? I guess you can put like a paper. There's a little... Oh, there's a slot in the middle. Maybe it's like... Yeah, I've seen like ones that hold like tag. little tiny pictures or something. <laughs> definitely looks like some sort of name tag. And look at the teeny tiny Autopia car. Mm. Yeah, that one definitely looks a lot older than the uh, Tiny Kingdom series. I see you're doing some shopping over here. Tiny. And <laughs> there goes the tiny ones. But what is remaining in here... Yeah, so this Jasmine one, this is a commonly faked one. And then the front page of the Pinfolio has more from the Pirates series. Oh, I, I, there's so many in this here. I didn't realize how many there were. I don't think we have quite all of them because I remember there's one with red on it somewhere, but I don't think we have that here. So we still got more to go in this collection. What? Next package. So what's cool about this one? This one actually came from someone in Hong Kong traded with me. And we, we did a big trade, to say the least. So this is probably one of the coolest sets from the whole package. Look at this. So I've seen these Toy Story characters before, but never with a Packer card like this. And then we have a bunch of little uh, tiny pins in here. I don't know what they all are from, but let's open them up. Hong Kong always has some really awesome pins. Look at this little green Duffy. And oh my gosh, the Stitch one. I really love the Toy Story ones they did. The Ham and then Rex over here as well. <laughs> and then this one's kind of cool. A little Shanghai, a little city. And these three here. These are little happy birthday cards that uh, are hinge pins. Aww. So there's Goofy and Mickey and Minnie. The 
this one's a little comic set. And then a Captain America lounge fly. So over here, it looks like we got some Easter eggs. And it's really cool to have these pins with the backer cards because these pins are commonly scrapped. So you can see them on the board sometimes, but I've never seen them with the backer card like that before. And these green aliens, these are these are really awesome ones. Little Andy's toy box. And a sparkly Donald. All right, just a couple left. Let's see what we still got in here. Ooh, look at this. We got the VIP pin collection. Well... A backer card fell, a backer rubber backing oh, fell off. That's cool. Let's see what we have in here. So that giant tinker, that one is a uh, little uh, keychain. Key and let's see what we have in here. There's Mickey Minnie, some sweaters. Flip the page. We have a golden Tinkerbell from the movie club. Some planes, Maleficent. A lot of these are movie club pins, I'm pretty sure. And look at that Groot. That's a pretty awesome Groot one because he's like a little, he's got a 3D effect to him. And Baymax, Baymax is pretty cool with the it's little, are they Japanese letters there? That was everything for that book. All right, next package. <laughs> I saw that Mickey back go flying. Oh, I know what this is. Look at this. It's a jumbo pin of some Dumbo ears. This is a really hard set to find. There, there's actually a whole bunch of different designs of this ear series uh, that were released for Disneyland's 50th anniversary. And yeah, so these ears are pretty hard to find because they're only a limited edition of 750, and they're almost 20 years old now. I want a cars one. All right, here's our last box to open on up, and we're already seeing some pin folios. <laughs> yeah, I know you busted into this package, huh? <laughs> Here's but, all mine right here. Oh, she already took out all the ones she's keeping. Got some nice little lounge flies in there. Some Little Mermaid. This one's really awesome. The submarine voyage with Donald on there. And a sword in the stone one. You good now? <laughs> all right, let's see what's inside the folio here. Oh, look at the stitch one. That one's a really cool one of him in New York City. And then a whole bunch of lounge fly, and there's this glittery princess one of Jasmine and Aladdin. Ooh, glittery pineapple. And then in our second pinfolio here, we got a whole bunch more lounge flies. This is a cupcake series, this cupcakes. villain one. I wonder what they make when you when you put them all together. Ooh. And who's on the inside? Lots more stitch ones. Mm -hmm. Marie Milk Garten, some yeah. Jack and Sally's. And look at all the Stitch ones in here as well. And a Funko Pop, a pop set of a Nightmare. All right, well, now that we've gone through all those, that's going to be everything for this video. It's always fun coming home to that much pin mail. So many pins, yay! But hopefully you guys enjoyed going through those with us. And if you did, be sure to leave us a like down below. And subscribe if you want to see more videos just like this. Have a magical day!